favorite city time is the dress right. okay, Tanya? I, I was just saying to Ria is that my dress seems it's not a sitting dress. It's not a sitting dress. <laughs> Beautiful I seem dress. To be <laughs> Your like, I can hide a few things under there. The posture. Snacks, the posture. breakfast. <laughs> No. But uh, you're here for good reason because we're going to talk entertainment and we're going to talk about the new host of The Daily Show. In case you missed it, have a quick look. <laughs> and to you, uh, The Daily Show viewer, both new and old, at home or on your phone, uh, thank you for joining us as we continue the war on bull. <laughs> 31-year-old fresh face. Kyle and I were talking about this earlier. What do you think, Trevor Noah, taking over for John Stewart? I'm excited for Trevor Noah. I like him. Like you mentioned, he's 31. He's got bright, shiny new eyes on the world, and he's he's maybe a little more relatable because, you know, he even said that he's a mixed race. He grew up in mixed-up places, and so he feels like he can just be thrown into any environment and be relatable to and relate with and relate to other people. You know, it's a changing in the guard of late night. We're seeing with Colbert uh, taking over for David Letterman and uh, Late Night has gotten that much younger. I like what he brought last night. The Kevin Hart interview was kind of a throwaway, but the monologue, <laughs> the monologue was razor sharp, though. He's, I'll give it to him. He'll take risks. He's with it. I also like that he said, you know, it's like this kid inheriting a beautiful home. Um, he's not trying to change what the foundation is because it's already got such strong bones, but he just kind of wants to, like, make it his own and start a new kind of life in this, in this home that he says. Also, the set. What did you think about the set? Uh, yeah, the set kind of looked the same. I know they said they changed it, but they I just said thought... they made a few changes. But we didn't really see that yet. But maybe eventually we'll see those uh, a little more and clearly gotta, down the line. We got to give him time to get comfortable yeah. with it too. So we'll, we'll follow it as Trevor Noah does his thing. And Show he's easy on the eyes. Just saying. See, that's good. <laughs> you can throw that out there. He's a good-looking guy. I'll throw that out there too. Thanks for yes. Sean Mendez doing great things. Canada's Walk of Fame, tonight. giving him a very distinct honor and ten thousand dollars to go with it. Uh, he's been chosen to receive the Alan Strait Award, which is given to a young Canadian making a positive impact in the music industry. You interviewed Sean Mendez before? I have interviewed Sean Mendez. He's so sweet. Seems really um, well-grounded and just down to earth. Um, I feel like he has great parents and a great family upbringing. Yeah. He's just, I just remember him being, being very sweet and excited to be a part of this machine that he's now ventured into. It is the Alan Slate Award, I'm just going to. Oh, did I say straight? Yeah, I'm sorry. Oh, man, just, I'm losing just, my vision. It's okay, it's early. It's I'm becoming fine. an old man. <laughs> oh, my God. I saw a team. What What's your name? <laughs> What do you think he's going to do with the 10000 Oh, so we'll it. find out. John Stamos is probably making more than 10000 in prime time tonight. <laughs> grandfather. He's a father and a grandfather. And then Rob Lowe and the grinder. Which one are you liking tonight? I am veering towards the Rob Lowe situation myself. <laughs> All right, now. Only because he's Rob Lowe and the man does not age. And again, he's easy on the eyes. Do you see a theme here? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Fall premiere week on City continues. Two new shows for you to check out. Uh, Russell Kate, uh, you got a you got a favorite there, Fred Savage. Speaking of easy on the eyes, I'm sure you guys were paying attention. You saw that Lil Wayne cameo there, didn't you? <laughs> Lil Wayne's sitting right in the that? booth there. Yes, he I is. Lil Wayne's. You're gonna have to roll that back a little bit there. That's a good-looking man for you right there.